Welcome to Downs in Two. Hi, I'm John Downs. I'm a master of wine and I'm on a mission to make wine simple. I'm just off on a quick journey looking into Stellenbosch Cabernet Sauvignon. Come and join me. At the tip of Africa, South Africa has a unique geography. With Cape Town at its hub, the Cape vineyards have to the east, the warm Indian Ocean, to the west, the cold Atlantic, to the south, the amazing meat of the two oceans, and to the north, beautiful mountain ranges. Stellenbosch is South Africa's largest vineyard region and is located behind Table Mountain. Stellenbosch and its sub-regions are home to more than a third of the Cape wineries and to more Cabernet Sauvignon than any other region. What makes Stellenbosch and Cabernet Sauvignon such great partners? <laughs> it may sound technical, but it's down to climate, soil and altitude. The climate is Mediterranean, with hot dry summers, wet winters and welcome cooling seam breezes. The vineyard soils include granite and sandstone. When it comes to altitude, the vineyards are planted on slopes and valleys up to 520 metres above sea level. The modern winemaker knows these vineyards well and juggles climate, microclimate, temperature, altitude, soils, grapes and much more to produce the ever-improving Stellenbosch Cabernet Sauvignon. Oh, one more thing, the reduction of new oak in the cellar is well worth mentioning. The age of the barrel affects the aromas and flavours of the wine. New oak barrels have a big impact, whilst three to four year old barrels have little impact. New oak was the order of the day, but the new generation have shunned this new oak regime and now blend new and old oak to let their fine fruit shine through. That's the latest Downs in Two, looking at Stellenbosch Cabernet Sauvignon. Thanks for listening.